can exploit the rotation of the vehicle to see in all 360 degrees. You can also virtually pan the camera to look in a specific direction. And you can fly in one direction and look in a, an entirely different direction. And that's what it's doing. It's just translating right now. If you are familiar with how helicopters fly, you can see that it tilts the rotor disc and translates in the direction of tilt, just like you would do in a regular helicopter. Dave, can you hover once again? Again, notice how nice and flat it holds its hover. This exploits the inherent stability you have in the maple seed that nature offers us. Just hover and fly around a few times. So the next thing we are going to do is have him bring it back to the launch point, do a land, and then it's going to take off again after landing, and essentially fly the same type of pattern. So that's a vertical land, and it's going to take off right now. So observe how simple it is to operate. You don't need to fiddle with anything or go change any settings. Fly is very simple and it's easy to learn how to fly. Now it's translating, just fly around again, see the robot is killed and be able to translate in the direction of field. Okay, right three and land on the Okay, uh, that's it for the second and last. 